Newton's understanding of gravity was good enough to allow us to fly from the Earth to the Moon, to cross a quarter of a million miles of space, to land on the Moon and then fly all the way back again. But it's, it's kind of got to make you laugh to think that you can go all the way to the Moon and back using something that's ultimately just an approximation. To find out what on Earth is wrong with gravity, we need to go beyond Newton. The problem lies not so much in what he understood, but in what he failed to address altogether. Gravity is working against me. There's a problem with Newton's theory of gravity. And that's that it just allows us to predict how things move under its influence. It doesn't say anything about why gravity exists or even how it works. It just allows you to calculate things. And Newton knew this, of course. He, he essentially just said that it's down to God. In fact, he said that the most beautiful system of the sun, the planets and the comets could only proceed under the dominion and counsel of an intelligent being. In other words, I'll give you the tools to calculate how the objects move around, but don't ask me how or why that is. That's down to God. To solve this fundamental flaw, we've got to take gravity out of the hands of the divine. We've got to discover for ourselves how gravity works. But our journey has only just begun. We've still got a long way ahead of us. <laughs>